at the eastern end of the Antarctic Peninsula. A massive ice shelf juts into the ocean. Known as Larsen B, this plate of ice has been in deep freeze for the past 12,000 years. But in the summer of 2002, something unprecedented happens. Larsen B completely collapses. A chunk the size of Rhode Island falls into the sea. Scientists are stunned. Something unusual is happening to ice all over the world. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> Nicely done. The glaciers of Patagonia are literally melting before Harrison's eyes, carving rivers through the ice, pulling into lakes, and tunneling holes that burrow hundreds of feet into the heart of the glacier. Harrison repels into one of these holes to get a closer look at what's happening inside the ice. Wow. The color's amazing. Harrison is not surprised by what he finds. More water. The, you know, this looks like a, a solid, solid world, but in fact, actually, the, the, all the ice here is melting. The wa there's water running through the bottoms of, the, of these ice caves. You can hear waterfalls in the background. This is a, basically a, a watery landscape, and uh, this ice is actually melting very, very rapidly. To Dr. Harrison, melting ice is the canary in the coal mine an undeniable sign that global warming is happening now.